I actually don't care about this one. All right, wow. This is a really good set. Wait, what the fuck? This looks like you have that disease from Game of Thrones. That's disgusting. Okay, I'm gonna go to another one. All right, Super Rug the Chosen. This is pretty much the full, this is the full ICC set. Minus like two pieces. Come on, bro, like what do you mean? Yeah, the grayscale. There it is. Yeah, this is a terrible fucking set. I'm sorry, Scooper Rogue. Tight Slayer Dusty. Uh, this is a pretty decent looking set, I think. Obviously, it's the shoulders from Xavius, the helmet right there from uh, Molten Core, the belt from the Sindaria, the Symbiote. That also can be the same. This is the same set as the gloves, too. That's a Heroic Throne of Thunder set. And the weapons are Tibu's Blazing Long Swords. Uh, this set's okay, I guess, but I'm not overly impressed by it. The sword is kind of cool, but there's nothing that's super special about it. I mean, I really just don't think so. Yeah, it's not that good. Blood Champion Salex. Wow. A full set. Absolutely incredible. Wow. Great job. I'm really proud of you, especially that helmet. Really good job. Just helmet just ties everything together, doesn't it? Absolutely amazing. With Armageddon on your weapon, that's the Armageddon that comes from the, uh, what is that? The first, no, the, uh, the four horsemen in Naxxramas 25, man. Could be a lot better. Rogando the Dreamer from the guild Failure Detection. I don't know, man. I, I really don't know about this one. I I'm not a big fan, honestly. Uh, I think, obviously, some of the pieces do match together kind of well. That's a chess piece here from Old War Tin Man. The belt from, uh, what is that? The Tier 14 DK set for, uh, obviously, DK's first tier, Mr. Vandaria. The gloves there from the DK 25-man uh, Axrama set. The shoulders there from Throne Thunder for DKs, the helmet from Garawan, the leggings and the boots there from uh, Wrath of the Lich King, and the weapon, which is the challenge version of the unholy DK artifact weapon. This is okay, but I feel like it's not really amazing. I, I don't like the legs and the boots. The legs are just, they're too skinny, man. It just, uh, it, it's, it just looks awkward, I'm sorry to say. Not a big fan of it. This is the same set that I've seen a hundred times. Last on DPS, number one on mechanics. Actually, McConnell was last on DPS. But good job. I've seen that set before. That's why I didn't want to go to it too much. What is this guy? The fucking Riddler? Yo, McConnell, do you see this? It's the fucking Riddler. This is amazing. I love it. Awesome, man. Yeah, this is actually, like, really, really good. I think this looks really nice. Everything about it looks really, really good. I like it a lot. Great job. Yeah, uh, he's green, the Riddler's red. Look, it, it's like a Batman villain. He's like the Red Riddler, okay? Even though he's not green. You guys know what I'm trying to say. It looks kind of like that, regardless of who it actually is. I think it looks kind of good. Alathonis the Dreamer from the Guild Gilders. Or, uh, sorry. Defenders of Gords. So, pretty much this whole set's shitty. Uh, let's, let's look what we've got here, right? Obviously, those boots right there come from, uh, what is that? That's Tumas Sargeras, same with the gloves. I'm pretty sure the weapon right there comes from the five-man Dungeons and Burning Crusade, and then also from BWL. That other weapon comes from, uh, Tin-Man Nextramas. The other pieces all come from Odoar 25-man. That's the Rogue set. And the gloves, actually, I do think come from somewhere in Wrath of the Lich King. This is a terrible-looking set. It looks fucking awful. It does look like you're about to raid Nextramas in kind of a weird, different kind of way, because obviously that weapon right there was a reskin model that came from Nextramas 40-man. I do like that. It does have that vanilla feel to it, even though it's not a vanilla set. I like that a lot. But overall, I don't think this is particularly amazing in terms of a set. Not a big fan. Boots are from Black Temple. Shadow Master's boots. I don't think that's from Black Temple, but I could be wrong. Uh, yeah, I, I actually don't know. Um, Fun Tango of the Nightfall from the Guild Wisdom. I think this is good. I mean, let's be honest. I think it's really good. Uh, I mean, the belt, the only thing that I don't really like about this set is the belt is a little bit off because it's just so high res. It doesn't mesh well with all the other pieces in the set because all of the other pieces are really kind of low res besides the shoulders. The belt is super high res and it just makes everything else look bad in comparison. But I don't think this is absolutely terrible at all. Uh, it's a nice looking set. It doesn't look bad. And it also is a Void Elf female set. So it's got that going for it too. Look from the back. It's a good looking set. The cloak actually does look really, really good. I like the cloak a lot. 
And uh, I think the uh, the wand looks really good too. Overall, I do think this does look good, regardless of the belt. Uh, this is actually a very well put together set. Combatant. Sanzaroth. In the Guild, the Driven. Listen to their song. This is the biggest dog shit ass piece of garbage set that I've ever seen in my entire fucking life. This is the biggest embarrassment that I've seen in this entire competition, and I'm honestly ashamed that I even had to show this on my screen. There's nothing good about this set at all. You look like a scuffed alliance warrior that was left in Voldoon to die, and he unfortunately got saved. There is nothing good about this. Everything is wrong with it. The colors look like you threw up on it. No, dude. Yes, dude. It looks like if a cat just ate a bunch of cat food too fast and he threw it all back up and only half of it was partially, uh, was digested and chewed up and the other half still has chunks left back in it. You know what I'm talking about. That's the difference between your legs and your belt. It's disgusting. This set reminds me of cat puke and it's a sh I, I, I just, I hate it. I, I legitimately hate this set. I, it, it's fucking terrible. Okay? It's absolutely fucking terrible. By the way, the gloves right there and the helmet come from the Zandalari set. The chest piece comes from Trial of the Crusader. The shoulders come from somewhere I think it's a leveling set. The tabard, of course, is the uh, Stormwind tabard, I believe. The leggings there come from normal mode... Um, Normal mode Siege of Orgrimmar for Paladins, and the boots are a random BOE green that you can get from Vanilla WoW. And the weapon there comes from War of Zedranor PvP. I think that's the Wild Gladiator's Bone Grinder. Combatant depleted from the Guild Friend Zone. Oh, I know Friend Zone. Me too. This set looks okay. I actually had some people that left our guild to join that guild. I told this story before, I don't want to get too far into it, but um, basically we had a few people that we uh, kicked out of the guild for being shitty, and they went and they joined Friendzone, which, oh. uh, which at that point was actually a higher progress guild than we were. And as more of the rejects from our guild joined this higher progress guild friend zone, they oh, slowly no. lost ranking until they finally were below <laughs> us. And I thought they actually stopped raiding entirely. It's really kind of funny. This is a decent looking set, but I think the weapon enchant doesn't really match at all. That's obviously the new Dreadflame enchant for PvP. And uh, the weapon in general isn't really that great. But I do like this. I'm not saying it's terrible. I'm just not a, not a massive fan of it, okay? Adderus, Lord of the Dragons from the guild, Ji-Hun Squad. Good boy here. If you're such a good boy, then why are you wearing a full set? This is a full, this is, I think, the full Warfront set with a different helmet that comes from, I think, Throne of Thunder, one of the monk sets in Miss of Pandaria. And that weapon, obviously, is also from Warfronts, too. I can already tell. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, that's the store one. Okay. Or not the store, the movie one. Uh, yeah. It's Okay. Right? It's an okay-looking set, but that's because it's a full set. Uh, I, I don't think it's that great. Hellfire Citadel Helm? Oh, is it really? Okay, wide, wide PvP Helm. I always get those confused. Overall, I, I don't really think this looks that great. Sorry to say, man. Medivac, Lady of War from the guild. Angry Mongoids. This is a very good priest set. The issue is that we have seen this preset a hundred times. Ooh. Right? I mean, let's be honest. We've seen this a million times before. This is the same preset that everybody has seen. Everybody's tired of it. Everybody's bored. There's nothing special about this at all. So if you could fix this up, make it a little bit better, maybe change up uh, you know, your gloves and your chest piece. Mongoids could not, un could not see Mongrorian. Don't. That's racist. He's Wait. being racist. No. He's wow. Just being racist. Racism on my stream? Get out of here. Just a second. Jeff Lebowski uh, of the four wins from the Guild for Science. I love this. I actually love this set. I, I think this is fucking amazing. So the helmet right there comes from the Burning Crusade five man dungeons. The shoulders, I don't even know where those are from. I don't even know where a lot of these pieces are from. This is an amazing, great-looking set. Swift Strike Shoulders, Jinx Hoodoo Set. Yeah, I mean, 
What? Do Whoa. You what? I like it. Yeah. Okay. Good. Chat's fucking stupid. They don't. Yeah. You what? guys have no idea. Yeah. You guys have no idea what you're talking about. You don't know what you like. I know what you like. Okay. I know what you like, and you like this set. This is a great looking set. There. Do what? Nothing. Yeah. I mean, like, I, I don't get it. Like, this is an amazing looking great set. How could you not like this? Either way, Jeff Lebowski, great fucking job, great fucking set. I like it a lot. I'm very proud of you. You're a good boy. Yeah, nature god, exactly. Blood Sail, Admiral, Zor Plox from the guild, no discipline. No originality either. Same Ooh. as last time, sorry. Trust me, I knew that. I've seen your set before. Last time you came in here with this set. Trat. Conqueror of Azeroth. Well, Connell, can you can you rate this guy? I've got I've got to take a piss. I'll be right back. Yeah. Uh. It sucks. Looks good, dude. No, it doesn't. Hey, that looks great, man. You got one of the best ones in the whole thing. Hey, get out of the get out of the screen unless you want to be kicked. I'm gonna kick you. I'm gonna kick you! <clears throat> Move! Yeah, nice titties. Nice titties. He's, yeah, nice titties. Oh my gosh. Oh, nice titties, lady. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, nice. Little titties. Oh, wow. <laughs> Yeah, nice shoulders, damn fucking shoulders. Whoa, they're the whole thing. Whoa, they, yeah, oh yeah, baby. Whoa. Would you sit down? What the hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing? The hell are you saying in there? Did you even wash your hands? No, bro. Like I've got a clean dick. I don't need That's to wash my I hands. Heard. I never, I never wash my hands That's after I take I a piss, dude. Even if I piss in my own hands, which I've never done, but even if I did do it in a hypothetical world, I would not, I, I would not wash my hands. You know what? I bet you have done that, and you just looked at your hands and went, you just scruffled up your face like you do, You're like, Ugh. and then you wiped it on your pants, and then went to play WoW. You're a disgusting animal. So that did happen, actually. That's actually true. That did happen. Gay Gatorade. Bane of the Fallen King. I don't even want to look at you. Rob Warlock from the guild TNA. Well, unfortunately, you have neither. And you also don't have a good trans mug. This is the biggest... What's a trans mug? It's that thing that you don't have. This is absolutely terrible. I'm sorry to say, Rob. Sorry, dude. It's got to be better than this. You're not an animal. That's okay. Right? The Life Forge Draenei Guard. Well, he'd have a better set than Ron here. Oh. Oh, shit, dude. This is actually really good. That so we got that. Yeah, we've got the helmet right there. The, um, what, what is that again? The, uh, PvP DK helmet. The shoulders and the gloves are normal mode Antares for DKs. The belt right there, I think that's one of the, uh, Relentless or maybe the Wrathful Gladiator's Girdle. Uh, I don't even know which one. It's one of the Gladiator's Girdles. The chest piece there are from Old War 25, man. The legs from Old War 25, man, too. And the boots from Wrath of the Lich King. And the Parrot Feather Cloak in the back. Holy fuck, dude. This is a badass set, dude. I actually really... I really, really like this set, dude. This is a great... Favor. What? Yeah. What? Yeah, you have the same set. Yeah, he just copied your set. That's why it's so good. Yeah, that's why it's so good. It's because I... Because I thought of it. Of course. I mean, duh. I mean... Alright. I'll pick out three winners. It's going to be pretty hard to do. Because there's only about... Uh, I don't know. It's just pick me yeah right slim pickings today boys third place third place is gonna go to titan slayer hypers from the guild violet dragon this is a perfect 
perfect Riddler transmog from Batman. I like it a lot. I don't want bronze. Fuck this shit. All right, there you go. Congratulations, Hypers, on bronze. Good job. You're a great player, and you're a good demon hunter. You're not a very bad demon hunter. There are demon hunters that were worse than you. I accept first place. Okay, that's good. Second place is going to go to Fun Tango of the Nightfall from the Guild Wisdom. I actually think this is a nice looking set. Everything about it looks good. I like it. And the colors are pretty much solid across the entire set. I really like the weapon there. I like the cloak. I like everything about this. So we're going to give second place to Fun Tango. It's a nice looking set. It's the second best set in the raid. Now first place. First place. Is going to go to Jeff Lebowski of the Four Winds from the Guild for Science. This is a good set. This is the best set in here. It's unique. It's different. He does look like a booger. But it's a good booger. And it's something that we haven't seen before. I like it a lot, Jeff Lebowski. Congratulations on first place. Let's have a round of applause, actually. I like this set a lot. Good.